in this video i'm gonna give y'all some good templates you can use instantly like templates you can literally go in here make on day one and it actually will be a good build for you if you don't want to make your own and you just want to use the nba player templates i'm gonna give you a few to use right, i'm gonna give you a few to use let's, let's do that now one of the more popular ones that i think is going to be used is this lamello ball because of the passing and dribbling and shooting i think a lot of people are gonna end up using this one i don't think this is one of the better ones it's cool but i can see a lot of people probably off rip just gonna pick this one and go i just see it because it's one that's the first thing that shows up they see shooting and playmaking and that he's tall so they're instantly gonna pick that one so but let me show you which one i would recommend over this one as a point guard the trey young i would recommend you go trey young because trey young actually this is a good build for a point guard man he, he's like six six one uh, 164, 63 wingspan. He's small, but look, he got an 85 three bronze limitless range. There you go. Um, he has a 95 ball handle. He's still gonna get gold speed booster, but he will get Steve Francis. You know what I'm saying? So, and you got an 83 pass accuracy. You'll be able to fling the ball around. You got a good layup. You ain't dunking, but most likely you're not gonna be able to dunk anyway. And no quick drops off one, so you're not dunking regardless. I think you'll be all right. I think you'll be all right. 87 speed. I mean, same acceleration. You're going to have gold speed boost and gold blow by. So you'll be able to zip around and shoot deep. Pretty good build, man. Pretty, pretty good build. You can't really go wrong. It, it'll get the job done. Horrible defense. But even if you made something like this yourself, it's still going to be horrible defense, most likely, when you have offensive stats like that. And he's quick. So Trey Young, not a bad option. The next one I'd recommend is the Paul George. You see Paul George right here? He got an 83 ball. You won't have limitless range, but you will be able to shoot pretty well. You better shoot pretty well. Driving dunk 85, you'll get good dunk packages and all that. Ball handle 85, pretty good. He's 6'8, so that's about what you're gonna get. Perimeter D 91, so you're gonna get like silver clamps and all that. Pretty good, man. It's a pretty good, good build overall. It's close to getting gold clamps. It's really close. Speed ain't the best, but you're 6'8. Honestly. You can't really go wrong with this build, man. It's going to be better than a lot of builds that people make on their own, honestly. It's a solid build. This Paul George build is very usable. 6'8", 220. You can kind of play spot up with it. You can kind of fit in with it. It's a good first build. It's a good build. You, you can't go wrong with this Paul George one. I, I think this is a good one, man. This is a good build. All right, let's go to the next. Next build I'm going to talk about is Drew Holiday. This Drew Holiday build is nice. I like the fact that he got gold clan. He got a high defense. He's 6'5". He's tall. Remember his height. He's 6'5". He's going to get silver speed booster. I think. I think he should get it. Actually, he might not. He might be too slow. That's The that 80 that 79 acceleration might make him have bronze. But regardless, he has 83 ball. Decent finishing. You can play good perimeter D. It's like a lock that can kind of shoot. 83 ball is a sweet spot. Sweet spot, 83 ball. This Drew Holiday build safe build to use jimmy butler in my opinion is a good one too i like this jimmy butler one because it's it's pretty well balanced you get a 79 three ball not the best you get decent defense you get a decent steal off rip you're gonna have like silver glove and all that stuff it's cool it's cool you, you can dribble a little bit you can score a little bit i think this is gonna be a popular one that a lot of people use because it's like a lockdown that's kind of can do a little bit of everything it's a little bit of everything type build. So you can't go wrong with this Jimmy Butler build either, man. I think this Jimmy Butler build, solid build, man. Solid build for you. Now we're going to go to the bigs, man. I think this Carl Anthony Towns build is a pretty good offensive build, man. It's, it's good offensively, man. You'll be able to post. You got a post control at 86. You'll be able to do post fades, post hooks. You got an 80 uh, layup. You got a 90 standing dunk. You actually probably be dunking on people. Top it off, you got a 90 mid range. So it's, it's like a popper. So you can shoot deep middies. Not only that, you can shoot a three with 80. And you got a good free throw. The weakness, it's not the highest interior D. It's not the highest block. But you have a, you'll get silver rebound chaser. Not bad. You're going to get a movable enforcer. I don't think this Towns build is pretty bad. It's one of the better centers that I've seen. Pretty offensive build, man. It's a pretty offensive build. It has a decent rebound. You'll be able to score pretty well. It's a safe build to pick if you don't want to go through the jazz of making like a shooting type center or offensive center. This is a good offensive center. And it has D 
decent defense. I mean, okay defense. It's not great. It's okay. With IQ, you may be able to work. You're not going to stop the, the super sweat inside centers. But you will get your buckets off. Another good one that I'm looking as I'm looking, man, Jalen Brown. That's pretty solid. I got an 89 midi. So you have a midi game. You got an 85 Premier D. You got some defense. 75 speed. You're kind of slow, but you're 6'6". Six, six. I mean, the other 6'6 six, six are going to be about 80 speed. So you'll be a little bit slow, but you have a 93 ball. Now, remember, these templates ain't the best builds anyway. These templates aren't the best anyway. I'm just giving you some templates that look as Jones approved that you should you should be okay. You know, these ain't no, no, don't think none of these are goat builds. None of these are goat builds. You're all trash in a way. In a way, but some of them are cool. Some of them you can get away with. Jalen Brown, it's not terrible. It's okay. It's, it's, it's decent. It's decent. These are all decent builds. Now, when looking at AD, here's the thing, man. AD's three ball kind of low. Okay. It's a 70. Because of that, I can't. I, like everything else about AD is cool except that three ball because I know y'all gonna struggle with that three ball That's 70 too low for most people. They not gonna hit with that three ball, bro I, I just know bro. I just know even though the stats besides the three looks good. The defense look good Yeah, you got silver anchor. I believe inside cool It's pretty balanced. Can you hit with a 73 ball? That's all it's gonna come down to bro. Can you hit with a 73 ball? Because of that, I can't recommend this one too much, man. I can't recommend this one too much. Uh, I just want to add this because somebody's gonna—I know somebody's gonna say something about AD. This is why AD ain't my top. I would not—I would not approve AD really because of that three ball, way too low. Now this one, this one. Now let's let's let me look at Clay. People may sleep on this one, but I think this one of the better ones, in my opinion. This might be one of the better ones. The reason I say this. It's 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 um bot approved. It's bot approved. It has a high three ball, which means most people are gonna green with it. Even if you're trash at the game, you're gonna get lucky and get some greens with it. You can go stand in a corner and you'll be cool. You got an 87 perimeter, you're alright. 75 speed, you cool, you six six. Um you got enough playmaking to pass the ball. This is just a shooter, bro. You just if for shooters, spot ups and wreck. Clay Thompson ain't bad, bro. You saw the old, the one clip with the dude shot half court with the Clay Thompson build. In my opinion, Clay Thompson is up there, bro. You can use Clay Thompson and be safe. Clay Thompson safe build. I like Clay Thompson. I like it. I think you should use Clay Thompson, bro. If you like the spot up, I think you'll be cool with this one, bro. It's 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 perfect for wreck spot ups. Cause you're not, it ain't like you ain't got no D. You got an 87 perimeter. You can guard a little bit. You're not, not no lockdown though, but you'll be able to hold your own on the perimeter. That's all you need to do. But if I had to say my favorite, it's, it's going to be Paul George. Paul George, in my opinion, got the most balanced stat. He got a 91 perimeter. That's insane. That's six, eight. I think Paul George is the best replica in my opinion. I think Paul George is the best template overall. So if I was gonna recommend somebody that don't know what they're doing, that just want a tall, all-around build, my opinion, Paul George is probably the best one, all around. He got a 91 perimeter D, bro. 83 ball, 85 dunk, 85 ball handle. Like he, what? Almost an 80 speed. This is the obviously the best one, in my opinion. It's obviously the best one. Westbrook, my guy. All right. They messed up Westbrook, bro. How, 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 first of all, first of all, I, I give him the three ball way too low. Alright, y'all, y'all, y'all taking the Westbrook meme too far. He ain't. He was shooting decent at the end of last year. Okay, he was shooting better than some of these people on this list that have a higher three ball. He should at least have a 75 off rip. 75, 76. Give him that at least. A 77 pass accuracy is insanity for somebody who is like one of the elite playmakers in the league still. But we ain't gonna talk about that, man. We ain't gonna talk about that. He cool, man, but he ain't got no D, bro. I would have recommended Kyrie earlier, but he ain't got no defense, bro. Like, he is nothing. 
I mean, you're going to have to stand in the corner. But offensively, you're going to go crazy. You still got gold speed booster, though. You don't have Holly. You're not fast enough for Holly. You have gold speed booster and blow by. Um, Midi Magician and all that. But it can work, though. You can make it work. You can make this work. I can see people making it work. Would I recommend it? No. But the defense is a little bit too bad. I mean, Trey Young's is too, but his stats are better um, overall. And, and it's better for Park. You know what I'm saying? But hopefully you enjoyed the video. I mean, let me know what your favorite template build is. What are you going to make? Are you going to make one of these or are you going to just make your own? Let me know, man. I want to help out the new people who don't know. You know anything about this, man. Hopefully, I enjoyed the video. To the next video, I see y'all then, man.